uh, the initial wind turbine. Uh, we did this wind turbine using bike wheels and uh, four inches PVC. As you can see, we took these two bike wheels of that were of uh, 22 inches of a diameter, and we took this four inches of diameter PVC two, uh, pipes and uh, cut them to the half, and then we then we put them together in here uh, using bolts, and with a distance of three of this uh, uh, between each uh, pipe. Then we put it, uh, put it into the, this metal frame, as you can see, they so could hold it. And after that, we use the gear from the bike. We got this black, the, this black gear is the, the greatest one, and we uh, connected this bike wheel and this chain into the motor that is using also uh, a gear from a bicycle into this motor and when this thing when the wind turbine spins also does the motor and generates electricity. Alright, now that we've finished assembling the wind turbine it's time to test its functionality. Right now we are in the high bay of the Balzer Technology Center. Obviously there's no wind in here since we're indoors, so we're using a squirrel cage fan that Ernesto is holding, which can produce approximately 10 mile per hour winds. And as you can see, that is more than enough to get the turbine going. Now that we know it works indoors, we're going to go, we're going to take it outside to test it outdoors in real wind conditions. Our final test was to test extreme wind conditions. We tested 40 mile per hour wind. To do that, we put it in the back of a truck and drove at 40 mile per hour down the road. And as you can see, it produced 20 volts.